Meet Casey, a quiet and imaginative child who loves to draw and explore new ideas. But today, Casey has been feeling left out due to the passing of her dad. I miss you so much, Dad. I pray to see your smile again. Sometimes when Casey sees other families together, it reminds her of that very special someone who's no longer here. Casey, would you like to create a kite? Let's create a letter and place it in the kite and send it to our dads together. Casey realizes how good it feels to have friends and family members there, to lift her spirits which make them smile again. At night, when Casey closes her eyes, she dreams of happy memories with her dad. And in those dreams, they were both drawing and dancing and playing video games together. I had an amazing dream of my dad. We spent a great day together. I'd like to prepare to take the kite out and fly it with the letter attached so it can reach my dad in heaven. Casey is filled with smiles and visions, seeing her dad face as he watches her fly the kite where he now rests in heaven. Casey, this is great, right? And it feels so good to see the kid fly high up to heaven. And so, with each passing day, Casey and Joey grow stronger and more resilient, knowing that they are surrounded by love and cherished memories. Remember when experiencing grief, it's important to allow others to help you find peace and comfort with the love that surrounds you. Talk to your peers, friends and family members to express your feelings. Hello everyone, I'm Kimberly Y. Griffin, the author of My Letter to Heaven. I wrote this story to help children that experience the loss of a loved one, like my grandchildren did, Casey and Joey. It's okay to feel sad sometimes, but always remember, you are never alone. Reach out to your friends and your family, and keep your deepest memories close to your heart. Thank you for joining us on this journey of healing and hope. I hope you enjoyed my letter to heaven.